An active investigation is still uncovering details about the shooting in Maryland that left two critically injured and the attacker dead. One America's Dana Alexa has more. An active shooter situation in Frederick, Maryland is setting off alarms, prompting federal agencies to begin investigating while a community remains in shock. This is certainly not the way any of us expected our Tuesday to begin. Uh, I just want to send uh, the city's uh, wishes to the families of the victims um, in the hopes for um, quick recoveries. Tuesday, authorities say Fantahoon Gurma Wuldesenbet shot and injured two U.S. Navy sailors at a Navy-affiliated facility before fleeing to the Fort Detrick military base. The 38-year-old, who was reportedly a medical lab technician of the Navy, was later shot and killed by police in a four-minute pursuit. We were given notice that personnel on the base had shot the suspect and he was down. When we arrived at that scene, life-saving efforts uh, were in progress and we were notified shortly thereafter that the shooter was reported dead. The two victims were quickly airlifted to Baltimore shock trauma. One victim remains in critical condition and the other is still being treated but is expected to be released on Wednesday. The city's chief of police called the event tragic but assured local residents the threat has been neutralized. No one wants to see this type of thing. Um, the most important thing that we want to reassure the community right now is that there's no further threat to, to the Frederick City and Frederick County residents. But for now, there's still very little detail on a motive and the gunman's relationship to the victim.